Howdy guys, in today's video with TrueCut already works, we're going to be looking at the combined curve feature that's located on your Extend Tools panel. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, we're back in the program here. Now, just a quick reminder, this is a mini series that covers the Extend Tools or Extend Tools panel, which is, or should I say, this little panel here on the right. Now, we'll also put relevant links in the description so you guys can follow along. Now, if for any reason you do not see this panel, you can quickly just um, enable it by going to your view menu on your main menu, and we'll navigate till we see Extend Tools. But I was selected. So now, now combine curves. Um, this will be the feature. Let me zoom in here. As you can see, it's got these um, node points, and then it shows the two that's separate, and then an arrow pointing to one that's combined. So basically, what this will do is if you have two um, curves that are um, uh, within a certain threshold of each other. You can use that tool to combine the two curves so then there'll be one so as you can see these are two separate here's the same um, uh, formula you can say but if we zoom in here let's find that you'll see there's actually a missing part now um, this is just the overview so i'm not going to go in too much depth on how to use it this is kind of just um, what it means when you see that uh, icon and when someone speaks about combined curves have a better understanding in future videos we'll try to go into depth of with all these videos on how to actually use the tool so now just the basics you would obviously need to select your curves you want to combine doesn't help if you just select one so in this case you'll select the two then you'll see the um, icon is now um, how can i say uh, you're now able to use it as you can see it's got color to it if we deselect curves you'll see it's grayed out so you need your curve selected then if you click that, it will give you a little um, error or combined error, which is in millimeters. And then you can now, it's from one to five or zero point, I think zero, zero, one to five. So depending how far your curves are apart from each other, then you can adjust this value as a threshold. And then when you say, okay, it will combine those curves if it's within the threshold. So I've already set up mine right. So we can just see, uh, so I've got you can see there are two separate ones but combine okay now if i select this you can see it's one curve so it does work but um like i said it's kind of more just an overview on your combined curve feature but otherwise yeah that is it on the combined curve if we had to head here to um software training.co.za you guys will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover and also you can isolate your search on the top right here if you do not, however, find the videos you're looking for, just go here, request a training video, and then we'll make that video for you. But otherwise, thanks guys for watching, and cheers.